Ladies and gentlemen, it's been several years coming, but we've finally done it. Matt's finally doing Mega Man 2 for us! <gasps> yep! Yay. Off of the Legacy Collection as well. Oh, okay. Bitch. That's pretty much how I did Mega Man 3, so we're, we're right at home. I, I promised right. almost two years ago, and I am going to finally keep that promise. How appropriate, because we're playing Mega Man 2. So let's see what our story is. Also, that's look at that smug grin on both of their face. Like, yeah, you know what you're <laughs> doesn't. Yeah. So, so just to let you know, this background is actually a preset pat of background you can get in the game. That's fine. And, it reminds, uh, me, it reminds me of the Virtual Boy player from GameCube. Yeah. So yeah, you. It's kind of like that. You. There's a border around it, and uh, it it helps because that way I don't have to make any adjustments to the video. Yeah, or have to stare at stare at two blank voids, but yeah, yeah like, I think yeah. every game has their own unique uh, unique uh, wallpaper for these games. So it's the year 20XX. Yay! No, it's the year 2000X. 2000X. Not yet, okay, not 20XX 20XX yet. 20XX wouldn't be until the until the, the Inafune developed Mega Man games. So, so 2000X and... Oh, that's right, because back then Inafune was just the designer of it. Yeah, he was just he was just the artist, and when you stop and think about it, like especially nowadays, that's really where he should have stuck. Just just doing just doing an art and doing all these crazy <laughs> ideas. Otherwise, so anyway, don't make him touch the game for a moment. Sorry, man. You go ahead. Go ahead. That's fine. So yeah, this is my favorite game in the series because well, for it's just like it's the most refined Mega Man game. Like it's the one that started it all. Anyway, aside from the actual Mega Man, but so shut up. But well, yeah. what, one of the things about it is that, um, in case you people are wondering, I am using no. the order that the Mega Man Wikipedia goes by. Now Wikipedia Wiki. Yeah. Wouldn't be some, wouldn't that be some shit if all the Wikipedia articles actually did list the Robot Master Robot Master um, orders as like? Boy, Game wow, Facts nice. would be in quite a tizzy if so. I don't know, right? Matt, that was shut up. <clears throat> anyway, oh yes, you're saying. I was about to say, that was quite ballsy if you had to jump on the platform while the guy was still on there. Yeah, it could have been stomached right off. I was like, please at least let me stay on the platform. Hooray! Matt's just showing, Matt's just showing off his pro strats. Yeah, move. They detect... If you don't move, he won't see you. The Mega Man detects movement. <laughs> so, so this is... So, so you're doing the order based on that. Uh, fun, actually kind of a fun slash stupid fact is... My order, my order for playing these games or playing the stages was I, I followed the, the Dwayne and Brando rap because they do rap like yeah. the, I, they because they, they do rap an actual like the, uh, an actual correct order to go oh, through them all. Boy, as as is the custom with Mega Man games, there's more like a loop. You can enter that loop wherever you want, but you know, it's just try and follow that loop wherever mm -hmm. you go. So he started from oh. the Airman. Yeah, so, some bo some bosses are clearly harder than others, and well, yeah. Well, Except, except in the case of Mega Man 2, where there, most of the bosses aren't really that much harder for, against, amongst each other, uh, say, oh. say for a few, like, say, oh, I don't know, Quick Man. Yeah. yeah. The anyway, and I'm not even talking about his stage, I'm talking about the man himself. Yeah. But I, I, yeah, I, start, I always started with Metal Man, because Metal Man, like, it's a really good starting weapon. Like, Smash 4 knew what they were, knew what they were doing by making, like, the Metal Blade, like, the de facto, you know, <laughs> yeah. all-purpose weapon. Only downside is that, compared, unlike Mega Man 2, the, the Metal Blade really isn't all that useful in Smash Brothers. Ironically, as well, the fr the, the most useless move in Mega Man 3 ended up being the one move I used a lot in Smash Brothers whenever I played Mega Man. The Leaf Shield? No, not the Leaf Shield. The, the, uh, the spin top. No, no, no. The uh, the top the, sp the top spin. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, that was well, his dash that's his, that's his dashing attack. Yeah, that's a dashing. Yeah. Which is weird because you would imagine you would think his also, slide would be his wait, wait. Attack. There's a Sorry. there's a glitch here that I like. You can actually get the you can actually Whoa. get the fat fan guys to disappear. Yeah, he's just spawned that. the sucker. <laughs> yeah, I I actually it, it usually takes me faster, but this is like the fourth time recording this level. Mm. Oh, and yes, and this is the best. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, well. But the thing, just to let you know, uh, this this whole series. I'm just letting you know right now. Full disclosure: I use save states. So I am mm -hmm. cutting, I am splicing footage together and now, And it is now at 4 minutes and 40 seconds and everybody <gasps> closed the tab. Guys, it's the, mo it's the impossible. No, 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 that's fine. Okay, yeah. Actually, this guy... Oh, Ooh, yeah, never that, mind. That was the e Alright, the thing is, I <laughs> always have a problem with Airman. That is the only time I not only beat him on my first try, on my first try, but 
also the fact that, um, I freaking, like, yeah, just quit, the quit. pattern, the pattern he shot at just didn't work. Ow, that voice. was really, that was the easy oh, part yeah. of song. Hey, message from Dr. Light. Oh, don't you dare. To be fair, this was the 80s. This, such dumb doves would probably oh, be, a, be a thing. I think that's the... the okay, board. so this is before the days of Rush, but this is, um... It's basically the Rush... I think it's the Hover? The Rush Jet. Uh, it's the... It's the Jet. Okay, the Jet. Alright, Hover is... Oh, wait, Hover is one, and then the Wall Climber is three? I think? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bam! And it, dep it depends on who you beat. Airman uh, is good against? Yep. Airman is good against... Crush man, okay. Not. So this yeah, is my so. okay. So I guess I guess another thing in terms of development is wasn't this also the first game that Yuki Chan Papa was started developing the music for? Or uh, do you also do I believe so. Yeah. Because I do like his composer co composition. <laughs> his composer. Actually, no. I think I think he did compose for Mega Man One as well. The only one I don't think he composed for was well everything afterwards. Uh, mm -hmm. like, uh, I wonder what his real name was. Why do you, why do you go by Yuki Chan Papa? Mm, well, to be fair, to be fair, this was around the time when like um, trying to make like trying to make the credits in an NES game was kind of hard because um, I don't space. know there wasn't much in the way of space to really make mm, very oh also this is a dick thing. Ow, Verticality yeah. didn't work with Mega Man until X. How do I avoid that? Ooh, also, it's life. life. <clears throat> I like that. Have a freebie. Oh, yeah. So it should be said, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> um, like We've already done like several <laughs> other Mega Man's before. I mean, we kind of start. We kind of inadvertently started with uh, Mega Man's powered up and Mega Man Three. So mm -hmm. doing Mega Man Two in a way does feel kind of redundant, but we kind of have a good reason for doing this. Well, one, we already promised it years years back. Two, Matt's the one that's do that's um record that's mm -hmm. hosting it for us. And it's three, it gives us an excuse to talk more about Mega Man Eleven. Yeah, let's mm -hmm. get to that. let's get yeah. to follow that. Also, should go without saying that this is my favorite Mega Man and the one I have the most experience with. But yeah, let's talk about that show. Yeah, th this is my favorite Mega Man as well. Mm-hmm. So, uh... Well, I'm not the one to follow fads. I still kind of like three a wee bit more, even though I hate the Doc Robot shit. I don't know anyone that doesn't. So that being said, I do go back... I do I do know Mega Man 2 almost to heart, so... I guess I could say something about how much I feel about the game. So what is 11, James? 11 is what's after 10. <gasps> it's a number. <laughs> but, no, yeah, no, it's the it's the new... It's it's the new Mega Man game that that's coming to us... Seven years after the last new Mega Man game, which was Mega Man 10. They and better right. have, they better but, start. Oh crap! Okay, nice. By the way, in a little bit, the uh, blue bomber here is going to become the blue bur blur. You'll see. Mm. Ow! Oop. My everything. Oh, this is. Oh, let's wait for a second. Mine. There you go. Ah. Jeez, you make it sound like Dr. Mario sound effects. When I was here for a leaf shield. I All I did Dr. was Mega just speed Man, up the and footage. I'm saving lives. <laughs> there you go. Nice. <laughs> but um, yeah. So as you're saying, hype about Mega Man 11. Um, yeah, um, quite a few interesting things about Mega Man 11. First off, and one that I'm particularly grateful for, it's not another Devil Day Mate bit game. Yeah, that I, that's appreciated. <clears throat> it's the it's the first 3D official like main series Mega Man game. <clears throat> Not counting Powered Up. But yeah, you're right. <laughs> well, Powered Up I'm, is a remake, but I mean, I'm, granted, I'm it, talking it, about numbered, not it, not remakes. Remakes do not know. count for me. All right, it's the it's the next continuation in the in the first big continuation to be in full 3D like that. Well, mm -hmm. fuck me. Why did it take so long to do do that in the first place? Uh -huh. uh, Capcom's lazy. <laughs> Maybe. Anyway, as far as I got, well, <laughs> oh boy. As far as, like, other things go, um, interesting thing about terms of getting power-ups from bad guys, like, like usual Mega Man Fair, you do have a color palette change, but now Mega Man himself actually does get physically altered, like, for example, when he takes from the, I'm just gonna call him Brick Man, he actually has, like, a more bricky-looking helmet and a giant brick gauntlet on his left hand. So that yeah. whole, so that whole ruse in Mega Man Legacy 2 was for a reason. <laughs> Wait, there's a ruse? Well, to be, okay, here's the thing. I don't remember. I think it was in the, either the Mega Man Nine or the Mega Man Ten art gallery, but that's where that whole Brick Man concept art for Mega Man was first found. Oh. Mm -hmm. Now what? Now what? I'm not sure is if that was deliberate or if that really was just a hint of things to come. I'm willing to bet it was probably the latter. Honestly, knowing Capcom can't tell if they're being lazy or if they're being accidentally successful sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> that <laughs> that that, that can, that can oh. actually describe their entire market considering Resident Evil. That's their actually, business plan. What happy little accidents? 
Happy little accident. But anyway, yeah. just something I meant to point out earlier, the <laughs> birds that drop the eggs and they shoot out the little birds. I just want to say, when the little birds swarm you, and I think Matt would appreciate this, Bird! 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 Oh yeah, Matt, um, <laughs> actually real quick, I think you, um, I'm trying to remember, you got item two, right? I'm pretty sure you could have used that to um, jump to the other platform without needing to backtrack. Yeah, you could have, I know they go sideways, but I, think, but I think if you just, like, you hop on one, send off another. Hop on one, send off, you could I know, I know, I know, but well, I'm hey, idiot. Just, well, hey, you know what, that's food for thought <laughs> for, your, for your next playthrough. Let the Mega Men tell you how to... No, no, I <laughs> I, the most I played Fuck with this, the, the most I ever played with this was the iOS port, but I still I still love this game. Yeah, yeah, and it still and it still flows with the new iOS ports of like all six games blow ass. Really? Yeah, like not gonna mince words. Like, I, well, the only one I have to go by is like the uh, is the one for two. But um, like the most recent re releases of them, you got all six games. The, even, it's even on sale right now and at a in a bundle. But like, first off, it's choppy as shit, and. Uh. Actually, you know what? Yeah, that's my only problem. It's choppy as shit. <laughs> that's another reason why I went this way. Ah, gotcha. But, um, anyway. Um, actually, aside from that, they do have, like, a, an option to increase the speed, but I don't think that really helps much, because... I mean, yeah, it does kind of make the game look look a little more akin to, like, what we have now, but it goes way too fucking fast to really handle correctly. Especially when dealing with all these... Well, of, of course, dealing with the bird enemies and such. Yeah. I can imagine. I think so yeah, right. honestly, don't waste your money on those ports. You use your money on something worthwhile. Like again, the Legacy Collection, which is also which that and the sequel are getting on, getting a Switch release. Fucking Thank finally. Goodness. So, so with that said, dead. you will be able to play. Sorry. I was about to say the same goes for every X game. Yes, including seven. <laughs> oh, it would feel great to be play be able to play X four on my Switch. Yo, my ears. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Sorry. Oh! No, you're not. So between, crap, so between oh. that, apart from Battle Network, Star, what the hell is the other thing called? Uh, Star Force. So apart from Star Force, Battle Network, and Legacy, and Legends, Legends you will literally have every Mega Man game oh. on the console. Also, you uh, can despawn the these guys. Hmm? Oh, that guy is Ooh. gone. But they just, <laughs> but they just cop, keep coming, and they don't stop coming. <laughs> and they don't stop coming. And they don't stop coming. Oh gosh, also, one! Also, this is where I discovered of a little trick. If you press oh. the Y button as opposed to the square button, I'm playing this on the PS4, by the way. Oh, that's the turbo. If, yeah, you can yep, do a turbo. turbo. It's turbo-tastic. Mm. <laughs> uh, Ow. Okay, run. Three run stop. You have E-tanks. Run. Just go. You have E-tanks, man. Run. I this know. Is I'm be, an this idiot. is not the time to be okay? grinding, man. There you go. But then I Just accidentally go too far. Thank goodness, past Matt. Keep going. Run. Shut up. Run and shoot, shut man. Up. Keep going, Shut Mega up. Man, for an everlasting future. I'm just um, going so. to leave. Do the Mega Man I, strut. No, Matt, don't leave. You're the one hosting. And just the whole thing just turns off. Also, Crash Man <laughs> is just fucking easy. Wow. Okay, oh. actually, it should be it should be said. I do remember. I did notice that Matt chose the normal difficulty as opposed to the difficult um, difficulty. It should um, the normal difficulty in this game is more so of an easy mode than the actual main mode of the game because oh. your but for one thing your Buster Shot's actually very freaking powerful to the point where you could pretty much go blow through most of the Robot Masters without breaking a sweat. So, I did not know that. So it's it's, it, huh. it's okay. Don't worry about it. But yeah, but playing the difficult mode is technically the true mode for me. Like it feels more like an actual Mega Man game as opposed to this, where it feels more like it kind of feels like a somewhat but not quite as easy version of the um, Mega Man powered up easy mode. Which is fine. Well, I which guess I fine. fucked up, people. No, which is no, fine. No, no, the, the, the point okay. of this was not to. The point of this was not to look at like, oh my gosh, we're being a hard game. It's more like we're just we're looking at all these games because we are trying. Our plan is to try and do them all in order. Also, I love this this track well, speed. <laughs> that's kind of thrown out the window considering we're we're going this far into two. There's a fantastic remix of this song. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, you're gonna do three, or I, I, I think we're gonna do four and five, right? No, I we're not, we already well, did three. If I'm gonna do the, if I'm gonna. Well, we did three already. Um, four, five, and six. I'll probably just do them for a look at, but I'm not really dedicating in Oh, that's right, because you're saying like after a while they just kind of got too same. They bl they blend they yeah. yeah they blend in after a while. And honestly, so, after playing Mega Man Seven, there's actually not much point in uh, playing Mega Man Six because it's it's essentially like a pro it's a precursor to like the whole super adapter thing that you get in Seven. So but, what are uh, we gonna do? So what, so what do we do? What what are we gonna do about nine and ten? Well, first Matt, let Matt say his thing, and then I'll say mine. Mm -hmm. Uh, so yeah, this is our ice physics level that. I I don't understand why it's an ice physics level. Because crystals are slippery, I think? Some might be. I don't know. 
I mean, I mean, that's essentially what this all is. It's, it's a crystal labyrinth of some sort, and, yeah, I'm, but pretty sure and I'm pretty sure that sniper stuff's. Joe. I'm pretty sure that stuff's not exactly well. The mo not how should I put this? It's not the most okay. Solid would really be the dumbest thing to say because essentially that's what they are. They're solid rock, but anyway. Yeah. But but anyway, ice fist, like ice bullshit ball. aside. Um, after this, I do plan on returning to the franchise with Mega Man Nine. Um, not sure about ten though. Oh, I'll do okay, ten. Thank you. Well, oh, okay. if you want to, really. I mean, I wouldn't mind doing ten. It's just that, um, I gotta wait and see how I feel after I after I finish nine. Because, which, funny enough, I actually haven't beaten Mega Man Nine yet. The furthest I've oh. gotten is through the and get to the. Oh God. Oops. I mean, I will. Me. I mean, I. But, I mean, I will say I, I'm I'm happy to be doing nine because nine has my favorite moment in the whole series. Oh, what is that? Agreed. It's, it. it's, it's it's in the ending, but um anyway, basic. But um yeah. Also, I'll, also. This is easy. A lot of well, people say this is hard. That is easy. But you're right. But you're right. But safe states, it is. No, I no. I did it on my first try. I did Yay. it on my first try. Crash bomb your way out of here. Yeah, I'll I'll let you know. The only times I used safe states were at the beginning of a certain Ooh. section or right before the boss. Okay. okay. Yeah. That sounds about right. But um, yeah. Um. So I'll I'll show you where I use the save state right here. Hmm. Yeah, just use the save state straight from the pause menu. Okie dokie. But um, anywho, here's our next robot master, the the ever oh so shiny and bold Flashman. Bold. Yep. So much hair. <laughs> ah crap! You're well. Do not, oh. run, do not run! Do not run! Do not run into him in the park with a trench coat. Okay then. Actually, yeah. now that you make that joke, Logan, it just reminds me of that one bit from Strong Bad. What's in the, What's in the coat, Bob's? I'm a public flasher. <laughs> oh, but by the way, uh, with this game, unfortunately, when I recorded it, uh, the flashing that happens to Mega Man's body when he changes colors doesn't happen. Oh, huh? Are you sure that Are you sure that's what it is, or, or or maybe it's also, or maybe like it could it could just it's a frame rate thing. Yeah, and your weapons what? It's the fr it's the frame rate thing. Okay, so like, gotcha. watch. You, usually, when you're playing the game, he would flash. But oh, it's, yeah, I was gonna say, you know, it's like that. It's like have, have you ever watched Have you ever watched a video where uh, someone got hit? In like in an old NES game, someone got hit, as a, and as opposed to seeing them flicker, you just see like trans, like you just don't see the character at all in the video. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like that. That's, that's I, I get that. That's exactly what it is. It's, it's thirty frames. It's funny thinking about it, though, because this doesn't really feel like a thirty frames video. I think it's fine. But yeah, yeah, uh, but yeah. Don't worry, dude. Don't worry. Not sorry. Don't worry, man. I understand you. Yeah. Also, just going back to what I was saying Bye. real quick, as far as the... There you go. Um, that whole public flasher thing, just for context, he wasn't actually flashing, he was just saying that just to hide what was actually in the coat. What was actually uh, in the coat? Legitimate goods. In fact, there was actually a thing, and Strong Bad <gasps> even called him out on, it's like, So you sell illegitimate stuff in your store, but you sell legitimate stuff in your jacket. I see yeah. some legitimate stuff illegitimately. By the way, I hate this stage. This oh, stage yeah. can't kiss does. my ass. Everybody e, does. For those wondering, those are one-hit kill. Mm -hmm. Yep, and let me tell you... Uh, hold on. Once we actually get to this section... Oh, boy. Ah, thanks for letting my way, pal. And, oh, <laughs> god damn it. Oh, it's so, so chilly. Here, warm up by the... You know, maybe... <laughs> Chestnuts roasting on. They're just. Oh god! Assholes roasting on an open fire. All right, I, I put a save state here. This, believe Go. it or not, took twenty-five times. Jesus Christ! Well, it's it's appropriate to it. like jump up and like. This is the kind of stage where you need to like have your plan like of where you're gonna go the second you hit the screen. You cannot stop. Every first timer's worst nightmare. Okay. And Actually, I'm like, going for the goods because honestly, you're not gonna have it. No, jeez. Yeah. Actually, oh. looking back at, it, I know those are supposed to be lasers, but honestly, they kind of look like giant popsicle sticks. Yeah. I get, I get, but, I yeah. get strings of mozzarella cheese with them. Ha having, those two. Having survived that, I was like, I yeah. survived. Man, Ron, you don't need to fight them. I don't care. I like fighting. 
Well, you are a super fighting robot. I I'm an idiot, okay? I'm an idiot when it comes to this You're game. Throwing away health. Just go for the metal doors. There you go. I said go for the metal doors. Did I have the oven on again? <laughs> Did I forget to change Otto's voice chip? Hmm. I no idea what you're talking like about. I know, that's the, <laughs> still making the joke. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so, all in all, I really do love this game. I, I look forward to beating it. It's just such a classic. I can, like, I can just, like, turn on and, like, beat it in, like, an hour. It's just a fun little... Oh. Yep. <laughs> I love uh... that. Does this just poison him? It, it takes down half his health. So is it poisoning him? Is like that's it's like is is he like can he can he not can he not stand like being standing still? Does it literally eat away at his very being? Possibly. Maybe. He, he, well, he is quick man. Uh, Ramona thought you said quit man. Quit, quit, quit man. Okay, okay, fine. Bye. I, I quit. <laughs> Get equipped you with quick. Quick. Boomerang. Boomerang. Devil damn it. Pink. <laughs> pink. Yay. Yay. We're, we're pink. deliciously pink. <laughs> All right. Anyway, that's our first episode, and we will be back. With more Mega Man 2. Bye. Bye. Mega, bye. This quick boomerang is pink. It reminds me nothing of the hunt. <laughs>